Welcome back to Crispy Comments Part 29. Let's get into it. First off, since I started making a pretty big series on mushrooms, I have gotten multiple comments from multiple different accounts trying very, very hard to sell things in my comment section. Just listen to the video and move on, bestie. Wrong type of mushrooms. Um, this one, while the comment's not bad in itself, that username is an instant block. No, I don't care if it's supposed to be a joke. It's not funny, even a little bit, so yeah, that was an instant block with that username right there. That This ain't it. We do not do anti-Semitism here on this account. Nah, -uh, no sir. Yeah, and that profile picture just adds to it. I don't care if you think it's a joke, it's not funny, and get a life and become a better person. Giving homeschooled. Giving peaked in high school. Giving I was a high school mean girl, let's talk about it. She a tweaker, for real. Huh? Geeked over a flower. Laugh cry emoji. No, 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 no. Tweaker. Okay. Why are you here? Know it all. I make your vids prive. No one should suffer and see that face of yours. Have the kindness to spare us what you cry over every time you... Eyeball emoji. In the mirror. <laughs> Um, one out of ten, I would give it two, but your grammar is making me sad. Woke up on the wrong side of the bed today, girly pop. Do we need to go down for a nap? Projecting much. OMG, can she talk any slower? OMG, you know there's a double speed option, right? If you don't like how I talk, either scroll away or speed it up. I don't care. The double speed option exists for a reason. I don't care. I watch videos on double speed all the time. Just just hold down in the right or left top corner and then it'll speed it up. There you go. You don't even look smart. How do you know this? I beg your pardon. Um. This person, I didn't screenshot it, but they later went on to say like, oh, it was a joke, it's fine, relax. Jokes are supposed to be funny. I don't know what to tell you, you just ain't funny, mate. Like, oh, haha, -ha, you were trying to be mean to a random person on the internet, and then I called you out for it, and you tried to cover your ass by saying it was a joke. Get a life. Three bangers in a row right here bothered me so much. Thank you for the constant hand gestures. I wouldn't have understood a word you, capital, said without them. Also, big props for admitting you're not a siphonophore expert. You could have fooled me. Said the same thing eight times. If it bothered you, scroll away. If you don't like my hand gestures, scroll away. Also, I am so sorry that I am not an expert on every single siphonophore species. Wow, I will change my major and my entire career path just to appease you. Then, scroll away. I don't give a shit. The hand motion is hilarious. Then, Ryan, I think it's acoustic. Thank you for making the least original and least funny joke ever to exist in the history of the internet. Do you know how many times I see this comment, not only on my videos, on um, other people's videos as well? Sometimes, in a row. Is it acoustic? Is she acoustic? Is she acoustic? Wow. You are truly one of the brightest minds of your generation. How did you come up with a comment so brilliant and original I've never heard before in my life? Certainly not one of the least funny things to come out of the internet. I'm proud of you for using your big brain to comment this on a video. It must have taken you so long to come up with an absolute zinger like this. 
I applaud your effort and I thank you for taking the time out of your day to put this comment on my video. I really appreciate it and I thank you for your service. She tried so hard to sound smart and you tried so hard to get a reaction to make me care. Um, zero out of ten. Not creative. Nothing I haven't heard before. Come back and try again with a better effort. Your vocal fry is unbearable. It's even worse today because I have a cold. If you don't like my voice, don't listen. If only I had known ahead of time. You don't have to keep watching the video. If you don't like how my voice sounds, if I am un- bearably annoying and so grating for you to listen to that you have to leave this comment on my video, you could have saved both of us the time and effort by just not watching the video. It's not my problem you don't like my voice. I don't care if you watch my video. If you don't like it, scroll away. And now you've wasted both of our times by commenting the fact that you don't like how my voice sounds. Beyond your wheeled house laughing emoji. You pretty much nailed it. Again, I'm so sorry. I am not a siphonophore expert. I will do better next time and devote my life to studying siphonophores just for you. Women! Laugh cry emoji. What do you mean by that, bestie? Um, he didn't reply after this, so I don't know what he meant. I'm assuming it was not kind thoughts. Of course, we can't have a crispy comments video without somebody commenting on my map. What is that map? Crying. There's nothing wrong with my map. And then again, of course, nah, the real question is, do you have New Zealand on your map? I hate to do this again. Map. Fine. New Zealand! You don't know things, as stated in bio. You look up things and then just recite what you googled. No, actually, most of the things I know come organically from learning about them through life and reading and school and all that. Um, just because you don't have a natural curiosity or willingness to learn new things doesn't mean that's the same for everybody. And yes, I do actually use Google quite a lot. It's this little thing that I like to call fact checking to make sure the information that I put out on the internet is correct before accidentally saying something wrong and then spreading misinformation on the internet for people to hear about. So I do use Google. LOL. People who say edible plants are invasive are the devil. They don't want free food. That's it. Fellas, isn't it, um, am I the devil to say that honeysuckle, which can take over large areas of native plants and choke them out and cause damage to the environment, are not good to be having around, really? I am a big fan of free food. I think food in general should be free for everybody since it's a necessity to literally live, and I think that more sh food should be grown freely and accessible accessibly, but it's a quick question. How much food do you think that you're going to get out of a honeysuckle? It's like, how much, how much food do you think is in there? Because you're not eating the actual plant. You're literally biting off the end and sucking the nectar out. How much food do you think that is? Bee hater planet killer. Free the plants, bee eat, bees eat it, you kill bees. That's, bees eat a lot of things. Um, they don't need to subsist off of invasive honeysuckle, which wasn't even the main point of the video he was commenting on, by the way. Then, Europeans are invasive, but we don't eradicate them. That sure is a take. There is a whole, whole topic that we can go into about colonialism and imperialism and how that's bad, but bottom line, that's murder. That's just straight up murdering people. An invasive plant is not the same as people. So yeah, these comments were spicy.